Hello, Internet. Welcome to the Empirical Sword. I'm Lawmaster Neil C79, and this is Rising World. And, uh, yeah, last episode, uh, I left off with the uh, I don't have enough stone to continue building on Parappa Palace. I have to go mining. But mining is boring, so I don't want to do it on camera. So what we're going to do instead for uh, this episode and probably next episode as well is uh, do some like improvings and some touching uppies, touching uppies of uh, uh, this little mining outpost. And uh, as you can see, I've already placed the remaining three furnaces. We need barrels though, and uh, I believe over here I just kind of free placed them. So. Um, why did I put it there instead of, uh, I, I don't know, I don't know, but I got to replicate that on this side as well. S but yeah, I, I kind of free placed them, so we're not going to be using the G. I do want to make sure it's not clipping inside the thing, because that's weird. Uh, that was not right, maybe. So yeah, th this is probably for gold. And then over here, kind of lined up with the this here, and then maybe like, not, yeah, that's that's too close. No, no, no more more like here, right? Yeah. And this will probably be for like uh, sulfur, and over here. Uh, it's kind of lined up with uh, this little pattern majiggy here. So, yeah, it looks, looks good there. Yeah. It might clip a little. Yeah, I do believe it's clipping a little bit. Yeah, I don't notice. I don't notice. I do not notice. Um, and of course it's getting light now, but I want it to be dark so I can place lights. It's dark when I want it to be light, and it's light when I want it. Uh, yeah. Uh, I have four lamp posties here. I can get rid of that now. Well, maybe not. <clears throat> so I just want to, like, mirror what I have on this side. So kind of. Maybe? Is that it? Yeah, that's close. So we're going to place this here. It's kind of lighter. Now, mirroring this one over here is kind of on this line here. Uh, it's more, more like this, I believe. Yeah, maybe. I mean, it's okay, but it's, oh, it's seriously off, and I can't pick it up. I cannot pick up this object. Yeah, I cannot pick up this object at all. That's a little annoying. Oh well. Okay, so lined up with uh, this line here. Yeah, that that looks good there. Yeah, we can see a little bit of the light. You okay, know that that one down there that. Why? My OCD is kind of raging now. See that one? That was pointing to the inside uh, of, of the barrel. It, okay, let me... If, if we think of it in terms of radial symmetry, this one is on the inside relative to the barrel. This one is on the outside relative to the barrel. Okay, just don't, don't, don't pay attention to it. Don't pay attention to it. Don't pay attention to it. I mean, as long as we're messing things up. There. There. It's, it's all messed up now. <laughs> I can't jump on that. Yeah, it's... Oh, because it's two blocks high. That's why. Okay. Uh, uh, so many things that I want to fix, but 
Doing so will destroy resources. And uh, unfortunately, this here, this is all the wood I have with me right now, so I can't build more of these to put over there. I mean, there's, there's more wood out at the uh, building site, but it's only one stack. And it's... I, oh, oh, oh. Are you fully grown? I don't think they are. Just... They... they kind of hypnotizing they are with the swaying. This could be a screensaver right here. Actually, no, wait, more like over here. This could be a screensaver. Just swaying palm trees. The the swaying palm trees screensaver. I noticed that they have like a definite preference. Like the one that I'm looking right at right now, it wants to go straight and then lean right, but it never leans left. See, watch, it's going to go right right now. Yeah, it goes right. But the one next to it always goes left instead of right. It, in a way, this is not exactly natural because they would all be swaying according to the same breeze. And um, being this close together, they would all be having the same amount of wind on them from the same direction. So they would all want to lean and bow in, in unison, more or less. Well, not really in unison. That's the hypnotizing part. They're all doing it in unison. And they shouldn't. The directions to be synchronized, but, you know, the amplitude and the frequency of their, of their oscillation should be unique to each individual one. It, and I, I don't know, how long have I spent talking about this? Like two minutes? <laughs> It's, little things like that fascinate me. Because it, it's like so counter to how it would be in the real world. I mean, they're all bowing by the same, in the same frequency, by the same amplitude, but in different directions. Which would make sense if they weren't so close together. Well, except for the same frequency and same amplitude. Those should definitely be different. Because they're all different trees. I'm supposed to be focusing on this, and uh, the, the the thing that I wanted to do, I, either this episode or next episode, is work on the lighting out here. It it's very yellow, and I I know it's because of I don't know why I jumped there. I, well, I know exactly why I jumped there. I hit the wrong button. <laughs> But the yellow light is coming from these. And it, it's... it's I, I've mentioned this before. I don't like the yellow light. It, it's very monochrome. So, oh, oh, yeah. I need to move this as well. We're going to G with this. Because I want to make sure this guy is lined up. Like right about here. But... Okay, can we can we keep you here? Yes. Now you're mostly centered, I believe. Pong. Yeah, this looks better. But now, uh, lights. I don't need these. I, I don't want that. Uh, that can be placed on walls. But, wrong button, but, I'm thinking of things like this right here, although, I guess, tech, oh, yeah, uh, I guess technically I don't need a light to be exactly there, um, I could place it like right here, maybe, maybe, um, I could probably have lights like here on the, on the ceiling, you know, then again, out here. That's the issue. And I, I really don't feel like... That is really disturbing. 
It's like I have a staircase down to nothing. But yeah, I, I really don't feel like I want to have you know, permanent air quotes lights down there. Because it's... I mean, I only need to light the bottom. I know I could I could pick up those torches there and then put them in, but it's that that's extra work I don't want to do. Uh, what, what, what I'm trying to focus on right now is where to put the lights that replace all these torches. Because I mean I mean ceiling here makes sense, but I don't have a yeah I don't have a ceiling here, so that doesn't make sense. And, oh, yeah, another thing that needs more light is this area here because it gets, like, super dark at nighttime. I mean, I can hide those, like, under all of this for now. Eventually, I get the feeling that uh, uh, Red 51 will fix the light going through blocks thing. And, uh, I'll need a different way of lighting that, then. Uh, the question is, what kind of lights? This only goes on the floor. Which is cool if I want to put lights on the floor. And that kind of doesn't make sense. I, I, how big is that, I wonder? That doesn't make sense. I could put this on walls only. Mm -hmm. that, that can hang from a ceiling, but it... it it looks like that. And now we're dealing with fluorescent stuff, which requires copper and... No, wrong button. And... Oh, I, I actually do have copper. Okay. <laughs> I, I thought I was very low on copper. Uh, apparently I'm not. How much iron do I have? A good bit. How much iron do I have to smelt? A good bit. How much copper do I have to smelt? Oh, this is what I was remembering. Okay. See, I was low on copper, just not the copper I was thinking of. Uh, but yeah, I guess maybe like I don't know. I mean, it's I, I don't want to put th those little these lamps in every single corner because th th this this already right here is very crowded. And really, I don't know when I use this. I mean, I know I use it a lot, but it, does it really need to be there? That's that's the question. I don't. I mean, I I guess maybe I could put the staircases. You know what? I could do that. I could totally do that. We're gonna move the staircase. And that's gonna go through the world. I caught it in midair. Okay, now I need the rake. And down, down, d down, up. Why? Okay, I need the mining tool. And now I'll need to replace that somehow. Don't fall through the world. There we go. Okay, now. Yeah, there we go. And I have one left. Why do I have one? How did I? You know, in the real world, when you dig a hole, and then you try to fill it in with the dirt that you got from the hole, you usually don't have enough to go back in the hole. Why is it I now have more dirt than I got from the hole? Um, conservation laws and whatnot. Okay, so uh, flip the flip the flip the flip the. Is that or is that? Is that which? G. I can't G with these. Uh, 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 climbing is climbing a thing. I I climbed it. 
I climbed it very awkwardly. Um, it's not exactly like I'm Nathan Drake or anything, but <laughs> I climbed it. Okay, so there and there. And now I need that block. That one ugly block that I swear I removed. And put you dare. Put you dare. Put you dare. And now I need to rake this. Just get rid of the, all the ugly grass. Not not the grass is ugly, it's just it it's too tall. I know I could use a sickle or a scythe. To, no, 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 no. I know I could use a sickle or a scythe to, to make it all nice and neat, but I don't want to. So, yeah, I'm, I'm guessing in every corner, maybe. So, what do I need for that? For the what what the, no the no this light bulbs and iron plates what do I need for light bulbs that's resources now isn't it yeah. iron rods and tungsten rods okay wrong button so we're just gonna make a ton wait a minute don't I have iron rods up there let me go find out why make iron rods when I already have iron rods. Again, the, the, the new stamina. I'm loving it. I do have iron rods. Do I have enough iron rods? Probably not, but let's find out. I'm going to need... How many? Two, two, and two. That's six. How many light... Wait, uh, uh, stuck. One and one. This is enough to make... 12. You know what? Let's make 12. Need tungsten rods now. Uh, that's going to be 4. That's going to be 12. I think. If I know how to math. Tungsten plate. Max. Tungsten rod. Max. That is 12. I do know how to math. Sometimes. Max. 12. Okay. Now... No. Yes. I'm going to need 4 times 6. It's 24. Uh, 15. 24. Run over here. It's a lot of running. Okay, now I should be able to make 6 of these. Okay, good. Now. Do the right button. G. Oh yeah. Uh, ta take. Take that. Taking that. Um. Yeah, it won't go inside, will it? Don't even try. That's stupid. Um. Let me. Am I inside? That was the problem. Okay. Okay, now over here. Take and take and take and take. Take, take, take. Take. Take the thing. Take. Uh, okay, so on this line right here. Don't jump track. There we go. <clears throat> Yeah, now we're doing the stuff. Yeah. Sort of. Anyway. Have I ever mentioned in this episode uh, why I love open world survival crafty building games like this? Is that really? yeah, 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 yeah. Freedom. The total freedom to do whatever I want. To follow my own course. Forge my own path, things like that. Uh, you know what? I, I think that's something that everybody needs in real life. 
at least more than they get. And I think part of the reason that we don't get it is they're just not taught how to get it. And in part, I blame the school system for this. Oh, this is going to be like right here. You know what? Let's do something special right here. Okay. But, uh, back on my uh, original topic. Uh, sorry, I'm, I'm just, I'm just, you know, like, <laughs> seeing what everything looks like. Because, I mean, there, there is a little bit of light that happens in the daylight. It's, just, it's very, very subtle. I'm probably going to have to wait until after sunset to uh, really see what this looks like. But anyway, uh, luckily for you, I have an entire playlist where I talk about the things the school should be teaching but isn't, and I will link that to you at the end of the video. It's probably on screen right now, or it, at least it will be. And uh, click under that if you feel like it, and I hope you feel like it. And uh, uh, thank you for watching. You don't have to watch, but thank you for doing it. And uh, if you want to see more videos like this, subscribe and hit the bell icon because the bell icon is how you get notified when I drop new videos. And uh, yeah, next episode, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm probably going to have a better idea of what this looks like at night because I, I, I really need to, see, need to see that before I continue forward with the lighting things up. And I just realized that everything looks very monotonous right now. I was a little too systematic, but, you know, it, it is what it is, you know. But anyways, next up episode, uh, more upgrading of the mining outpost, and uh, I will see you then.